Our today's video is about Stats Tester. This application. You can download this application from Google Play Store. Through the use of this application, you can analyze your sample data through different statistical tests. So let's begin. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Tap on the application. When you open the application, you will see two panels. The first panel that you will see is for the parametric tests, and the second panel is for non-parametric tests. First, let's begin with the parametric tests. In the parametric panel, you can see different tests names. You just need to click on these tests and input your data, and then it will calculate for you the desired results. So first, let's begin with the mean, SEM and ST, the top button. Here you can see on the top six buttons: Help, Example, Grab, Calc, Clear, and Share. Below these six buttons, you have a white area with the name Data on it. You need to type your data here in this window. Below that window, you will see another button named as Copy Results to Clipboard. And below that button, you see the results of your calculations. If you don't understand how to use this application, then you can use the above two buttons. That is the Help button as well as the Example button. The Example button, when clicked, it will fill the uh, white area, the data area, with an example data, and then you just need to click on the Calc button. Now, first, let's clear the data. Now, as we are going to calculate the mean and uh, standard error of the mean and standard deviation, we need to put your data first. So, just type your data like 12, and then you need to click on space button and then another value space third value space fourth value space and fifth value etc and then click on the button calc so these are the results in the lower most window you can see okay now let's click on the graph button so these are the three uh, bars and uh, the first one shows the mean plus minus SEM. The second one is with mean plus minus standard deviation with N numbers and the third one is with N minus one. Let's go back and then let's come to the one sample t-test. The same buttons and same panels here as well. As this is one sample t-test, you will require data from only one variable. First, let's clear. When you clear the window, the first row says enter population mean to this line. And below that, you will have to enter the sample data. So first, we need to type the population mean. For example, population mean is 25. Then click enter. Below that, you will have to enter your sample data. So our sample data is 23, enter 24, enter 25, enter 25, enter 23, enter 12. Okay, so this is our data. Then click on calc button. These are the results. P-value is 0.790. Click on graph button, go back, go to the paired t-test. So here they have shown two columns for two uh, data before and after because this is a paired t-test. So you will have to enter the data before and data after. First let's clear the data. You can click on example button to use example data or you can type your own data for typing one and then this is for the group one the first data and then space the first data for the second group click enter second data for the 
first group space second observation for the for the second group and then click enter and so tap all the data now click on calc button these are your results click on graph this is the graph go back then click on t test student and wells test clear clear so this is a t test so we will need uh, data from two different groups two six nine five so this is the data from group one and then this is the data from group two now click on calc button graph for group a for group b go back f test example data as you can see the data in group a is written vertically and the data in group b is written horizontally you can type data both vertically as well as horizontally if you are typing the data vertically then you must press enter between every uh, two observations and if you're typing the data horizontally then you must type space between every two consecutive observations so you can clear group b and type the data vertically as well with enter button and then click on calc these are your calculations you can click on graph this is your graph let's go to one way ANOVA so in one way ANOVA they have four different groups I think you cannot use more than four groups here in this application so put your data for example I have put three groups data I click on calculate button these are our results this is the graph for three groups okay multiple t-test example data it's the multiple t-test click calc graph and then correlation regression click on example so as this is a correlation so you will need to uh, one the dependent uh, set of data and another uh, the independent set of data and then click so one is from x variable and another is from y variable click on graph this is your graph and then you can click on non parametric panel and these are the tests for non parametric uh, variables click on median put example data calculate graph go back go back man with new test example data so click on calc and then graph you can go to Wilcoxon signed rank test example data for from two groups calc okay graph chi square test enter the observed and expected frequency in the first row in the second row you will have to type your example data for example I placed example and then click calc graph Fisher exact test example data 
calculate go back spearman rank correlation test example data from two groups calculate and then graph so that was all for today about the stats tester thank you for watching my video bye